Yo, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to Get Jacked here in Ark Survival Evolved. Now, what we're going to be doing today is actually heading out to the Lava Island. It's in the very north on the center map, and we're actually going to be taming up a Giga. Now, in the last video, I was out there, and I noticed this 110 Giga, and I don't think anything... I mean... Nothing's going to kill it, obviously, so he should be still over in that area. So I'm going to be heading out there. I've got everything stocked up. I've got, like, six guns uh, so, because I've, you know, I've tried this before, and I usually run out of guns and have to start over. So I've also got tons of darts, uh, Kalian soup. I'll take one of those, actually, now uh, to protect me in the lava area. And also, I've got tons of narcotics and everything that we'll need to get this team going. Alright, so I think I see him in there. He is... Okay, yeah. Still stuck in the rock. They're real smart, by the way. He's been in this rock for like three days. Aren't you hungry? Alright, let's see here. I believe it was 110. Yep, 110. Look at that. And it's a female as well. How perfect. Alright, so I'm gonna get this... I'm probably just gonna land above him. If he stays in this rock, I'll be able to trank him for a while here. Otherwise, I'm probably going to have to chase them back and forth because they actually do move around a lot. Now, when you're trying to tame them, they won't really get stuck for very long. So, you ready? You ready for this? Now, you need to be careful around this Giga Tapajara. Please, just be careful. So, we'll stay right here. He's going to stay right here. And I'll probably just grapple around if we need to around this rock. So... Let's get this started. This is probably going to take... I looked up the taming calculator. It said it's going to take probably around 340 darts. Yeah. This is going to take a long time by myself. But, I mean, I just... If you didn't notice, I just struggled forever to get those guns reloaded. But we should be all set now. Anyway, let's... Uh, oh. Oh, he can't reach us from here, can he? I guess I didn't really check. I think we're good. He just kind of bit at me, though. All right, let's kind of crouch. These these rocks don't really have definitive edges. Okay, I missed. So, let's see here. Whoa, hey, what are you do? What the heck is he doing? Why? Get out of there. Oh my gosh. Good thing he didn't bite. Wait, what? The What just happened? <laughs> wow. Okay, well, now we've got to do this on foot. Great. Um, shoot. Okay, so I honestly don't know what happened there. I, <laughs> the bird just felt like it was time to attack. I didn't even hit the Giga with the dart, so I don't know what, what was going on. But anyway, I had this little base over here that I've been using for the caves and whatnot. So I also had this Argent, so I might as well just use this, and I guess it's not too big of a setback. I was able to restock and whatnot. It's just sad that I lost that tap of jar. So now we definitely have to tame this Giga because he, he took the life of that guy. So anyway, we're going to get started. I'm just going to, you know, trank this for probably the next hour and a half or so. I think that's probably how long it's going to take. This is going to take a lot of darts and a lot of time. So let's knock this thing out.
right, so it is finally freaking down. It took so long, like, honestly, it, and I had a server crash about halfway through, so I had to start completely over a second time, unfortunately. So, it's finally down, and I am not doing this again. This is ridiculous uh, for one person. Too many darts. I did about 30k damage to it over the tranking process. That is ridiculous. Okay, so I had to quick run and grab the bird. I've got the tranks, or the narcotics, I mean, on me. Look at this. Look at how fast it went down. I just ran over and grabbed the bird, and that's, a, that's as far as it went. So, basically, I'm just going to pump all these in. Okay, so I pumped all of them in except that 100. Now, he should be set. I shouldn't have to worry about him for a while. So, we're going to get some prime here. Come here, you. The nice thing is, these Demetrodon everywhere, they actually give a decent amount of prime. Yeah, get him, Apollo. Kill this thing. So, we're going to get some prime from this guy, and I'm definitely going to need a lot more. This is going to be a pretty long tame, but fortunately, the knockout process is over, and that takes the most amount of time. All right, we murdered it. So, you stay there. Don't, don't collect this stuff. All right, so this should be a decent amount of prime to start out with. There we go. Let's see how much it does. Toss all that in there. How much did that do? Oh gosh. Alright, this is going to take a lot of prime. Fortunately, on the lava island, everything pretty much is made out of prime because every, all the uh, dangerous stuff's out here. So, I'm going to tame this thing up. I'll probably uh, stop in again in a second. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Look at that guy. Let's shoot him. You can't reach me up here. Oh, I didn't even notice. You didn't even feel it. Come here, you. What the heck? Oh, he's coming. He's just, he's just kind of walking slowly. He knows he can't get up here. Are you going to die? What level are you? Oh, and by the way, if you notice on my hotbar, I actually had to make a magnifying glass as well because I, was, I couldn't believe it was taking as long as it was. So I checked him with a magnifying glass when I was able to get close to his head. And, uh, yeah. So I <laughs> I was really worried that he wasn't even getting tranked. It was taking so long. Die! All right, dead. I was only level 55. Okay, so we're about... Halfway through the tame, or a little bit more than halfway through the tame. Still just loading them full of, of prime meat. It kind of sucks. This guy's taking forever. I'm running out of prime meat in my area, and I'm having to, like, branch out now. Alright, so, just finishing collecting up the last piece of prime, I think. I needed just one more. I thought he was going to be all finished up being tamed, but it, he, he got, like, right on the edge of the taming bar. Oh, he just came up! That means he ate a regular piece of meat. Oh, I missed it. I didn't get the... Dang it, I didn't get the thing unlocked in my journal or dossier or whatever. Dang. All right, whatever. We'll have to tame up another one. So, 161 is what it tamed out at. Holy crap. That's a... Well, I mean, not quite a perfect tame, but almost a perfect prime tame. All right, come here, you. Oh, yeah, check it out. Let's check out these stats. Can you land on these? I want to, like, put my bird up here because <laughs> anything... I can't park the bird on the ground because there's, like, stuff attacking all the time over here. Fortunately, they don't attack... Can I land on you? Nope. But fortunately, they don't attack him when the... he's on the ground being tamed anyway, so I didn't really have a problem with that at all. So let's see, stats-wise... I don't know. I can't. I don't really know what to compare it to, but those look pretty dang good. All right, so we're swimming. <laughs> I have to make it from island to island to get back to the redwood forest. This is gonna take a long time, but I'm gonna stop at like this desert island over there, or right next to the like lava island right here, and we're gonna kill everything. I'm just gonna kill as much as I can, get as many levels. Maybe we can get this guy up to like level 200 on the walk back or something. Because it, it, I'm based, I'm literally on the other side of the map, and getting these guys back and forth is not a fun process. So we gotta go all the way down to that pond in the middle of the redwoods. So this is gonna take a while. I'm gonna clear off this island first because we're gonna get so much experience from this. Oh my god, I almost died. Oh, almost just lost him going across the water. He's down to 7,000 health. Wow. 
Oh, wow, okay. So we gotta be really careful. I'm gonna buff up his oxygen a little bit so that he can actually make it across the, the redwood area because I don't want to go all the way to the waterfall. And I don't really care about this guy's stats. Let's see his base stats. Look at it. Not a problem. <laughs> yeah, like, do I really need more melee damage or something? I don't know. I'll pump it up anyway. But let's do some killing here. Alright, so this is definitely the strongest Giga I've ever had. It's now at level 200, and right by my base is the stupid Titanosaur. He's been just walking around, it's been pissing me off. So, we're gonna attack it. We're gonna see if we can kill this freaking thing. Let's see here. Well, we, we can always run if we need to. Oh! Alright, we're doing alright. He's not doing that much damage. We're good, we're good. Alright, keep attacking. Keep attacking. Oh! Hey, wh what? No, uh All right, well, uh, the Titanosaur killed me off of the Giga. I don't know what that's all about. I didn't, I didn't know that was possible, but I was able to get the Giga back. I was not able to get my supplies and stuff back because I shot in some weird direction, I think. But anyway, that's where we're going to stop for today. If you liked the video, definitely hit that thumbs up and or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You all have a great rest of your day, and of course, we'll catch you next time.